What if I told you that you could go and have all the effects of a stream deck or, or almost all the effects of a stream deck for free in a couple minutes? If you want to know how, stick around to find out in this YouTube video. Hi guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If I'm in the same outfit, um, yeah, I thought I looked cute today, so we're just gonna go and crank out some YouTube videos before I run out of ideas as to what to film. If I sound like a frog, I also kind of lost my voice last week. It came back, kind of. We'll see how long that lasts, though. I thought of an idea for a YouTube video. Uh, it actually is a spin-off of my previous video, although it might not be my previous video given the order that I will edit my videos in, but it's how to go and use your keyboard as a stream deck. I have a full keyboard, so I use my number pad on my keyboard as my stream deck, where I just hit it to go and swap my scenes. You can also buy an external number pad if you would like to have the same effects of a stream deck. It is so much cheaper than a stream deck. It's The stream deck is like $80 minimum if you're getting like the bare minimum of a stream deck, and an external number pad is as cheap as $10 on Amazon. If you have a keyboard that is smaller than a full keyboard, you can use some of the extra keys like the F1, F2 or something like that oh, um, or a combination of key button presses to swap your seats. I will show you how. But yeah, here is my keyboard right here and then I have my number pad and so when I click these keys, it will swap my scene. So for proof, that's zero right there. That's my period button I swap to. I have two scenes where I swap my camera from either the right hand side to the left hand side depending on like what i want to cover on my stream look at the inception anyways um one is my just chatting scene two is a zoomed in three is more zoomed in hello five is my red zoomed in scene by the way i am making a youtube video and uh -huh. you can make this red zoomed in scene as well so it should be up by the time this video is up but honestly i don't even know anymore and then we're getting a little bit too up close and personal I don't know what this scene is for, but um, I, I, I also have this scene for some reason. But yeah, you basically get the point. I use my number pad to swap all my seams around. Click, click, click. So in order to do so, what we're going to do is we're going to go under settings and we're going to go to hotkeys. So you just kind of want to scroll down. So you can already see that I have um, stuff bound per scene. So over here, what this is named this is the name of your scene. So I have a raid scene, I have a subathon scene, I have a zoom scene, etc. So under switch to scene here, we just want to hit the the number or the letter or the key on our keyboard that should correspond to the button we press to swap the scene. All right, so I'm gonna go make it my page down key simply because it's a key that I don't use very frequently. I recommend using keys that you don't frequently hit. Like I don't recommend like enter for example as your key because otherwise you're going to be swapping scenes left and right once you have it set you just want to hit apply and hit okay and if i were to swap to a different scene like my youtube camera scene and hit the page down button bam now we've swapped to our youtube desktop capture all right and this is a quick and simple video as to how you can use your number pad or your keyboard as a stream deck for your stream really recommend getting an external num number pad if you don't have a full keyboard because it's a really great way just to get a cheap, cheap, cheap... because it's a very great way to get a cheap stream deck. If you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you checked me out on Twitch because I do stream five days a week and it will link be linked down below. Sorry, literally can't speak today. And I hope to catch you in another video.